The growth in our Colorado has revitalized an area in Denver we now know as Rhino. Now, before all of that growth, though, it was home to a homeless shelter, and now today a promise that it will stay. Denver's buying the Salvation Army Crossroad Shelter for $10.5 million. Liz Gillardi joins us live with insight and just why the city took this action, Liz. And Shannon, we learned today there have been several unsolicited offers to buy this building and none of those offers had anything to do with running a homeless shelter here. So that's why the city got involved. A crane towering overhead and new buildings popping up. Denver's growth has transformed this area, creating quite the demand for real estate in Rhino. When the Salvation Army opened the Crossroads Shelter in 1993, this area looked a lot different. We were very concerned that it would be repurposed uh, for you know private development or something of that nature. Mayor Michael Hancock says the city couldn't afford to lose the 400 plus beds that are here. We toured the facility to see how the staff handles that demand. But our nightly capacity here is 476. Right now, in the summertime, we're about 380, 370 a night. But as soon as the temperature begins to drop, again, we'll be full every night. The city will lease the building back to the Salvation Army for three years, letting them continue running the shelter, even though they no longer own the space. The building needs significant investment. We previously reported on fire code violations, and at the time, a staffer said the shelter needed a million dollars to meet safety code. Our goal is to not only do safety improvements, but we believe we can do, a again, a broader approach to homelessness right there. And we're going to start by making sure we don't lose the, the, the beds that we have have there and then take it a step further and say what more can we do in this? The Salvation Army originally bought the building for one dollar. It was essentially a donation from a local company and now they stand to make 10.5 million dollars from the city of Denver money they plan to use for good. It would be our intent to uh, reinvest those into enhanced community programs that will help our homeless neighbors in need uh, through programs of the Salvation Army. So we and really the biggest question in all of this is what will happen once that three year lease is up? The Salvation Army says they would like to continue serving their homeless neighbors, hopefully here or somewhere else. Liz Gillardi, Denver 7. Thank you, Liz.